want HD PSP games? Well, follow these simple steps. And today I'll be showing you guys exactly how to get these games in four times the resolution. Like and subscribe and let's get started. All right, guys. So first things first. If you want to play PSP games in HD, you're going to need a PS Vita, obviously. Secondly, you're going to need a mod your Vita. There's a bunch of tutorials online how to mod your Vita. Um, pretty simple process. After that, you're going to get this app called the Journalin, which is basically an internal PSP emulator. After you get that bad boy installed, you're going to click on it twice because it always lags out the first time for some damn reason. I don't know if that's just me, but that seems to be an issue, but not nothing too concerning. Either way, once you have this bad boy, that's the, that's the step. You're going to need to get some PSP games, obviously, right? But um, I would recommend an app called... PKGJ. I need to download an app. This app is not on DB Downloader. On this one, you can download different apps, applications, and plugins and stuff. But um, that that you won't find this app anywhere right here. Auto plugin. This app it's easy. Just you know, try to find it online. You definitely find it easily. Um. After you after you look for it, there'll be either a QR code or a direct link. Get the direct link, set up a FTP server. I'm showing you guys um, how to do this real quick off of a one I downloaded off my Android phone real quick. Let's get to it. All right, guys. So you're going to go to the Google Play Store because you're going to need this app called FTP Cafes. That's what I use. You just need... An app to connect your phone to an FTP server to your Vita, right? And um, there's a bunch, there's a couple different ones, but this is the one I use. You're gonna go into it for the profile. You can pretty much name it whatever you want. If you go to if you go to um, your Vita, you're gonna change from USB mode to an FTP server on the Vita shell. And I'm gonna be showing you guys what I mean right here. All right, so now that um, you go to the Vita shell, you go ahead and you press start. And once it's at FTP server, it'll show you your IP address. Um, and then that's what you're going to put as the host. And um, you're going to go to more properties. And it's always the port is always going to be 1337 for all Vitas, okay? Make sure your phone is connected to the same Wi-Fi as your Vita. Then then hit um, save and then connect and this should connect right away like instantly pretty much it doesn't take long and after it's connected you're gonna go ahead and get the file that you downloaded um, auto plugins is is the name you can go to Google or whatever Google's your friend and um, look for auto plugins you'll find a, probably one of the first websites you find It'll also, it'll have two options. You can download the QR code or you can download. Okay, now that I showed you guys um, how to set that up, you know, just go to the Google Play Store if you're on Android. And then um, simple as that. And um, get that installed. Once you got that installed, you're going to, once you got that downloaded, you're going to want to go to the home. You're going to go to Vita Shell. So you're so basically you have a ha hacked Vita, you have Vita Shell, and you have a journal in and you've downloaded a couple games by now. Um, and you downloaded that thing I just told you to download as well. You're going to go to it in your downloads and you're going to install it from this app. Once you install it, it'll pop up. So you'll have it now. You'll have it, you'll have auto plugins now. But after you have that app installed, if you want if to you, if you press start on Vita Shell, you go down here where where it says USB and select FTP server. 
you're going to press select and that's going to show you your IP address. And then that that's what you're going to connect your FTP server to. You're going to download the app off the Google store like I showed you guys. And um, that's how you get your IP address pretty much. And then you're going to transfer over the file you downloaded from your phone, transfer it to the Vita, then install it on the Vita shell. So say you down, say after you transferred it over, just go to wherever you transferred it and then hit download. I'm not sure where the hell I did, where I downloaded it. I think it's in my downloads. Yeah, here it is. These are all the VPKs Vita shell. So as long as you download your VPK right there, you'll install it and you'll have auto plugins. That's the next app. You're going to click on auto plugins. Simple as that, right? So just a few more steps, guys, to get your PSP games running in HD. Nothing too crazy. You're going to go to PSP plugins. Plugins for a journal in. We already got a journal installed at this point, so we're going to go to this patch right here called GE Patch Plugin. What this does is it says it right there in green. Let's re it says um, it allows you to play a few games in native resolution, which pretty much upscales your games uh, all the way up to four times. But there, there is a um, small compatibility list, so I say this with a grain of salt, not all games work. You can always Google on the compatibility list and you can see which games work best with this patch. Unfortunately, the guy who created, I already have this um, installed. As you can see, I have a little green. Just press X and it'll install. But since I already got it installed, you just install that plugin. You exit out. And um, you're going to go to Adrenaline straight up. This is the next step, going to Adrenaline. Alright, alright. We need some music. What the come on, Piers Vita. We need some music. Speaking of music, you guys are not gonna want to miss out on my next video because I'm gonna be showing you guys. I'm one of the only few people I believe An error has occurred. who oh, try again later. I'm one of the few people. Sorry about that. Um I'm one of the few people who found out about um this new plugin on a journaling. It's actually very old, but I figured out how to put music PRX on it. And you guys are not going to want to miss that. But anyways, back to the point. After we got that, the next step is to go to Adrenaline, right? You're going to go to Adrenaline, but here's the tip. You're going to hold the R button. Hold down the R button. And what that's going to do um, is... I know for sure it's so called it works. To make it HD, you're just going to press X. You don't have to do anything. If I wanted to load it not HD, you just hold down the L button and press X at the same time and that'll cut it off from being HD. But I loaded it in HD. So let's see how good it looks. Soul Calibur in HD. Native resolution right here. With the GE patch. You guys are going to see. I mean, look at how crispy the image looks. Damn, that's a PSP game, guys. To remind you guys, this is a PSP game. You see how it's glitching out a little bit? Um, well, at the screen it was. Even right here, it's glitching out a little bit. That's gonna be um, a common theme with, when you're playing different games. You'll see sometimes it glitches out, but it'll still be a high ass resolution. For example, I'm gonna be using Kratos. Let's see how good he looks in HD. I'm just gonna get in a fight right here. Every battle is connected to the two opposing swords. I will make you suffer. Alright, this is a bit four, or this is a HD, and I'm gonna show you guys I'm gonna cut to a non-HD. Alright, this is HD. Oh! Oh, oh, I'm getting my ass handed. Hold on, hold on. I'm gonna cut this out. I'm gonna cut this out, guys. I'm cutting my uh, I got it. Damn! Oh, hell no. I'm coming back. I'm coming back. If I win, you guys gotta subscribe. If I win, you guys gotta subscribe. Oh! Oh! <laughs> 
Let's go. You coward! You coward! Let's go, baby! Who are you fucking with? What's Kratos out here, boy? Got three in this bitch. Oh! Bitch. Oh, God. Fuck. Okay, well. That was the fucking... That was it. I fucking lost, guys. HD. <laughs> Alright, guys. This is after. As you can see, the foliage doesn't look as crispy. Kratos doesn't look as crispy. Look at that. Yeah, I see. I see the more pixelated. Kratos looks straight up like a fucking PS2 on. He looks good as hell in there. What's up, boy? I Kratos the God of War. I ain't taking no shit, boy. New honor, boy. Take that, boy. That was lit. Oh, nothing. Yeah. Oh, shit.